Analysts speculate on whether Bitcoin will witness a massive drop in price or experience a significant pump. Will the spot Bitcoin ETF approval become a sell news event and signal a potential shift in market dynamics? Stay tuned as we talk about the latest news and analyze charts to see where Bitcoin is headed next. It's Joel Peterson here from The Crypto Code, bringing you your latest Bitcoin and crypto market insights. Love our content? Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so you never miss out on our market updates. And hey, why not join our free Telegram and Facebook groups for daily trading insights and top-notch crypto education all for free. If you're curious about how we profit in the crypto markets, whether they're soaring or plummeting, and want to know more about our automated strategies, be sure to check out our free workshop. As a fun bonus, workshop attendees who take a quick quiz at the end will receive $10 in Bitcoin from us. No strings attached. Just our way of saying thanks. Check out the workshop page for more details. You'll find links to the workshop, our Telegram, and our Facebook groups right down in the video description. Now let's jump into today's market report. A quick reminder, everything we discuss is just our opinion. We're not financial advisors, so please do your own research. You know how it goes. So Bitcoin, the largest digital asset, experienced a little dip. It's been down by 2.4% in the past 24 hours and was last seen trading at around the $42,200 level. Like Bitcoin, Ethereum also saw a decline in its prices and was last seen changing hands below the 2,350 mark. Rumor has it that the Securities and Exchange Commission will be giving the nod to the spot Bitcoin ETF applications before January 10. Now everyone's pumped about this news which will potentially bring in a fresh wave of crypto investors. However, we're also hearing analysts talking about a new selling event which could shake things up. Since the ETF buzz started, Bitcoin's been on a wild ride. It's up by more than 60%. We're looking at big price swings on the horizon, so brace yourselves, folks. Looking at the market in general, Bitcoin's losing a bit of its dominance, opening the door for altcoins to shine. Traders and investors are also feeling optimistic after MicroStrategy doubled down on Bitcoin. Right now, we're seeing Bitcoin wrestle with resistance pegged at 43,500, with support resting at 41,000. Okay, time to pull up the crypto code trading dashboard. Guys, I can't say enough good things about this tool. It's truly a game changer. Aside from being highly accurate, it will tell you the perfect time to buy, sell, go long, or go short. On the one day chart, Bitcoin's in the green zone. It is trending up with a 53% chance of an upward movement in price. Switching over to the weekly chart, we're seeing that Bitcoin is also on an uptrend. However, we're also looking at a 99% probability that the asset will experience a downward movement. Taking a look at the Renko one day chart, we're still in the green. For those of you who are unfamiliar with the Renko chart, green here means go long and red means go short. The fear and greed index is saying that we're at 65, which indicates greed in the market. Usually this means that it's time to consider cashing out some of the profits you made on your trades. If we take a look at the crypto bubble chart to see a snapshot of the market, Today's top performers are BSV, SEI, and HNT. It's mostly green across the board with a few reds. All right, let's take a quick break from the charts. And I'd also like to take this opportunity to give a quick shout out to some of our amazing crypto code students. First up, we have Kate who made a huge 272.80% on a bonk trade. And we also have George who made a respectable 19.51% first win on a Sol trade. You can see more success stories like these inside our members area. To join them, just register for our free workshop. Links in the description. And remember, we're giving away $10 in Bitcoin just for participating and taking a short quiz. Let's dive back into the charts and take a look at the one day chart for some of our favorite altcoins on the crypto code. First up, we've got Ethereum. It's been in the green zone since November 10th, but it's also displaying a 73% chance that it might catch a downward breeze. Next, We have got Gala, which has been in the green zone since December 7th. Gala is currently riding that upward wave with a 59% chance that it will experience a downward movement. Last on the list is Mina, which has been in the green zone since November 9th. Mina is trending up, but the chart is also displaying that it has an 81% chance of a downward movement. Let's wrap up today's episode by taking a look at and analyzing the Bitcoin liquidation levels heat map. If we closely observe the 12 hour liquidation levels for Bitcoin, it's currently hovering around the $42,200 range. This indicates that there's a potential path toward reaching the $43,500 mark. The crypto code trading dashboard is a game changer. 
it would have tipped you off to buy Bitcoin at $15,500 and to sell at the peak of the last bull market. Imagine having a tool like that. Our mission at The Crypto Code is to guide you through the crypto markets, focusing on consistent profits, whether the market's up or down, through trading and automation. Interested? Check out our workshop and grab your free $10 in Bitcoin for joining and taking part in a fun quiz. No purchase is needed. Workshop, Telegram, and Facebook group links are all in the video description. Thanks for tuning in to today's market report. If you want more content like this, give us a like, hit subscribe, and turn on those notifications. This is Joel from The Crypto Code. Take massive action in life at whatever you do. Catch you in the next video.